All right, guys, back for a little card-related video. I haven't done one in a while, so I just uh, just sort of cleaned out a little bit that I had on uh, PWCC, some fun cards. I'm just bidding some cheap bids, throw them in on, like, Monday morning, and whatever I get, I get. I kind of put a max bid in, and it's usually pretty cheap. And sometimes you win, sometimes you don't. Most times you don't, but I had some good ones, so some fun ones. And uh, I guess the point of this video is to let you guys know, is PWCC really worth worth dealing with? So thing is I got uh, it cost me $40 US to ship the cards but I will say they did come fast they were here like two days later via FedEx so it was crazy crazy quick shipping Just can't say that I'm uh, disappointed in that but then I had to pay the duty I'm Canadian so I had to pay a little bit of duty it was like a hundred a little over a hundred bucks kind of a pain in the ass but it is what it is and uh, I think I got a pretty good deal I got some ad cards to add to my PC dirt cheap so I'll show you what I got Okay, first card, got myself a Mason McTavish, little stud there, PSA 10, add that to the PC, I don't have one, super fun card here, Victor Olsen exclusive, I think I paid 40 bucks US for this on there, so like you can get some deals, so I just kind of throw up these cheapo bids and if I land them, I land them, if I don't, I don't, and uh, I'll add the cards to the collection, I don't think I paid over $50 for any of these cards here at all. So I'm pretty happy. I might have paid a little more for this. I can't remember, but it's not much more than that if I paid it. So PSA 10 exclusive. Olufsen. Really good. And this is a PC card. I paid five bucks for this. So I'm super stoked. I think that's the minimum bid you can put in. Uh, at a 199. Let's see if we can show it there. Or no, sorry, at a 75. I know it's only a PSA 8, but I don't have a I don't have a Godwin. And I'm a big Bucks fan. So it's been pretty good. And then I put in a bunch of bids because I kind of like this guy. So I got one. Let me see if I can show you this. Okay, I got one. Get that proper focus. Two. Three. Four. Five. God, why is it focused? There it is. Five. And number six. Arthur Kiliev. So I really like him. Um, I don't know if he's going to play steady or not, but wow, just look at his stats in the juniors. You know, he's like a almost two point a game guy. Got a uh, really good player. So a lot of fun. A lot of fun to watch. Dirt cheap. A couple of people I know are super high on him. So. What's going on behind that glass there? Weird. It's on the inside too, I think. Huh. Crazy. That's all right though. Those are going my. I might sell a couple off. We'll see. I think I, I paid twenty uh, less than twenty dollars because I think I put my max bid on those at twenty dollars US per. So cheaper than the grading fee. Can't complain about that. And you're guaranteed to ten. So I mean, and I got myself a Wayne Gretzky PSA eight. I think I paid six dollars for this. So, can't complain. This one here, I couldn't believe I got. I got this for like 25 bucks or something. Patty Pimblet. I'm a big uh, fan. And this one's, at a, this one's at a $199. Pretty sure. Yeah, at a $199. 46 at a $199. Patty the Batty rookie card. Those were like super hot there. So, to pick that up for that cheap, super stoked about it. This guy here is a stud too. William Eklund. The Sharks. That's the only problem with him is he plays for the Sharks. Alex Newhook, PSA 10. I think I paid like less than 20 bucks for that. Jason Robertson paid less than 20 bucks for that. PSA 10. And my favorite card, which I was trying to get a 10 of myself and I just couldn't do it, but I just bought one. I mean, he was hurt this year, but he's a stud. So Maddie been here, so I get to put that in. So overall, the experience is great there. Um, they really have it dialed in. Um, it's all the little hidden fees that kind of suck about it, but overall, uh, I'll keep bidding. I, I like adding stuff to the PC, stuff that I'm not into it for a bunch of money. I can sort of justify it and have it in the collection. Anyway, guys, thanks for checking us out, and we'll try to get a little more regular with the card videos. Don't forget to subscribe, all that good stuff.